We all know that electric vehicles come with two major limitations, weight and range. Despite this, there are a host of manufacturers that disregard these limitations and bet on the main advantage of electric motors, high torque and quick acceleration. So today we'd like to make an overview of the newest off-road vehicles that could tackle any terrain provided you have a full charge. Let's get started. Dust Moto Model 1 Dust Moto is a young American electric motorcycle brand that, despite its age, likes to dream big and sets an ambitious goal of becoming the most recognized American dirt bike brand on an international scale. The company's first product is called the Model 1. It's a battery electric dirt bike with performance-oriented geometry, a rugged chassis featuring a chromoly front triangle, an aluminum swing arm, and a subframe. The model is equipped with a closed cartridge suspension. 21-inch front and 19-inch rear dirt bike wheels, and powerful brakes with 260mm front and 220mm rear brake discs. The company's engineers claim that Model 1 will offer 368 pound-feet of torque while retaining its weight below 200 pounds. Besides having obscene torque capabilities, the bike's motor can produce 26 kilowatts of output and grant a 60 mile per hour top speed. The 3.5 kilowatt hour hot swappable battery is good for up to 35 miles of continuous riding. It can be recharged in about two hours and needs just one minute to be replaced. Dust Moto Model 1 can now be pre-ordered and deliveries are scheduled for the second and third quarters of 2025. Avenir Spiritus Legera Wait, what? This can't be real. These were my first thoughts when I read the news about the upcoming EV model by Avenir Electric Vehicles. I have a feeling that I may not be the only one, so feel free to share your initial impressions in the comments below. Although the initial presentation showcased the Spiritus Legera in the form of a digital render, the company's engineers have been working tirelessly on turning fantasy into reality and posted their progress on their official social media pages. So, what's the Spiritus Legera? Well, it's a three-wheeled roadster suitable for breezy rides on the highways as well as for tracking dirt trails. This dual-purpose functionality was achieved with an adaptable suspension and switchable off-road tires. The front suspension is represented by a double wishbone design with an adjustable pushrod, while in the rear the designers decided to use a trailing arm suspension layout. In terms of performance, the Roadster is offered in three trim levels. The base Sport trim comes with a rear-wheel drive, a single 4-kilowatt electric motor, and a 4.6-kilowatt-hour battery pack. With this battery capacity, this 518-pound EV will reportedly go for up to 65 miles between charges. As for the range-topping Ultimate trim, it offers an all-wheel drive system with a three-motor powertrain capable of producing 10 kilowatts of output and 368 pound-feet of torque. The powertrain was also matched with a 10 kilowatt hour battery pack good for 127 miles. Gogoro is a Taiwanese company that revolutionized urban mobility with its brightly colored electric scooters with a unique battery swapping technology. Even though today Gogoro is considered to be one of the leaders in the e-scooter market segment, we have to admit that lately the company has not been especially active in terms of producing new models. Luckily, this situation is about to change as Gogoro is set to start selling a new adventure-oriented scooter in 2024. The manufacturer calls their new creation a two-wheel SUV, probably hinting at its advanced mixed-terrain riding capabilities. To live up to such a name, the model received a completely redesigned all-terrain frame with an improved rigidity rating compared to previous generation Gogoro products. Besides the improved frame, the model brings a wide array of features and components that should let you confidently take the roads less traveled, namely a robust suspension with a telescopic fork in the front and a dual shock absorber in the rear that offers 5.6 inches of ground clearance, 12-inch high-grip dual-performance tires, hydraulic disc brakes, as well as the traction control system. Moreover, if you do decide to go on an overland adventure, the scooter has 18 liters of trunk space, 26 mounting points for your gear, and ultra-bright full-time LED headlights to let you properly see and be seen at all times. 
The scooter will be offered in two performance variations, Crossover and Crossover S. The Crossover will be utilizing a water-cooled PMSM motor with 7 kilowatts of peak output and 144.5 pound-feet of peak torque. The Crossover S variation gets a performance bump to 7.6 kilowatts and 151 pound-feet of torque. One battery charge would grant you up to 93 miles of range at speeds up to 45 miles per hour. E-Quad We are constantly monitoring the latest EV news and product announcements, and we can assure you that all electric powertrains have little to no representation on the modern ATV and UTV markets. It seems that the people behind the Detroit-based company have noticed this market disparity too and started developing their battery-powered E-Quad. This ATV is based on a sturdy tubular frame and recycled carbon fiber body panels that can waistband harsh road conditions and protect vital electronic components. Moreover, considering the model's off-road nature, great attention was paid to the protection of the batteries. The 16-kilowatt-hour battery pack is reportedly hidden inside a waterproof stainless steel case and supports wireless charging. Energy from the battery is transferred to a dual-motor powertrain with a peak output of 16 kilowatts and 67 mph top speed capabilities. The manufacturer estimates that every battery charge could bring up to 170 miles of range autonomy. Among other publicly available technical specifications, we'd like to highlight hydraulic brakes, a four-link rear suspension, an independent front suspension, a GPS tracker, and a smartphone control app. Ride One Up Rev DRT When initially announced over a year ago, Ride One Up Rev was touted as one of the best value offerings on the moped-style electric bicycle market. To build on its success, the San Diego-based company decided to produce a more off-road-oriented version of this two-wheeler. Named Rev One DRT, the bike brings a series of off-road upgrades that were not present in the original model, namely a rugged alloy frame with improved geometry, a full suspension setup, moto-style fenders, and spoked wheels with 20 by 4 inch knobby tires. The bike is initially programmed as a Class 2 bicycle, which means that you can use multi-stage pedal assist or throttle power to reach speeds up to 20 miles per hour. However, Rev1 DRT has functionality allowing you to activate Class 3 or the off-road mode that unlocks the full potential of the 1000 watt motor and speeds beyond 28 miles per hour. To efficiently control these speeds on the trail, the model was equipped with a powerful four-piston hydraulic disc brake setup with an electric cutoff sensor. Such a powerful motor setup had to be matched with a 52-volt 35-amp controller and a 52-volt 20-amp-hour battery pack that guarantees peak performance for distances from 30 to 60 miles. Arctic Ride Skik Finland is known for having some of the harshest weather conditions, so it's not at all surprising that this country is home to inventions like the Skik. Described as a hybrid between an electric scooter and a snowmobile, the Skik is advertised as an ultimate solution for all-weather commuting. It features a three-wheel construction made with a sturdy black powder-painted steel frame. In front, you get a knobby ATV tire with a 1,000-watt electric motor hidden inside its hub, while in the back, you get a choice between inflatable tires with aluminum rims for summer riding and skis for gliding on snow. The motor draws its energy from a 48-volt, 20-amp-hour battery pack suitable for operating in cold weather conditions. This motor unit can propel you to 15.5 mile per hour speeds and last for about 25 to 35 miles on a charge. This adventure scooter weighs above 143 pounds and could be used as a traditional kick scooter when the battery charge runs out or be folded down for easier transportation or storage. Exotech ExoQuad Exotech is a Norway-based company that has developed a new electric mobility vehicle that should unlock full off-road exploration potential for people with different levels of physical abilities. Designed as a motorized wheelchair, the ExoQuad features a lightweight tubular aluminum frame with rollover protection, 
20 by 4 inch fat tires, a robust suspension setup with almost 200 millimeters of travel, and powerful hydraulic disc brakes. The ExoQuad is offered with either a two or four wheel setup. The heavier four wheel drive modification weighs about 200 pounds and relies on two 3.5 kilowatt rear hub motors and 600 watt front hub motors. The motors are juiced by a removable battery with 2.1 kilowatt hours of capacity. The riders may explore the great outdoors at 4 mile per hour speeds in the four wheel drive mode and 9 mile per hour speeds in the two wheel drive mode. The battery will reportedly last for up to six hours. Our team is working hard on bringing the latest and greatest news from the world of electric two-wheelers. If you'd like to support our efforts, please subscribe for further updates and feel free to share our work with your friends or request new overviews in the comment section below. Thanks once again and till next time!